the worst curtsy I've ever seen. Royal watchers blast Meghan's bow to the Queen of Tonga as too short as the couple's tour comes to a close. The Duchess of Sussex has been applauded for her grace and style throughout her time on the Pacific tour but it seems even royalty occasionally slips up. Royal watchers have criticized Meghan's curtsy after a video has circulated on Twitter during her meeting with Tonga's King Tupu VI and his wife Queen Nana Zipua'u last week. She and Prince Harry met the king and queen for the opening of the Commonwealth Canopy Tupu College and as is custom for a duke and duchess, greeted them with a bow and a curtsy. Greeting the king first and then the queen Meghan, 37, shook their hands before giving a short curtsy to both. However, Twitter users were less than impressed with the short curtsies the Duchess performed. Sharing the video royal fan account, the Duchess of Pemberley wrote, Those were the two worst curtsies I think I've ever seen. I wonder if maybe she wasn't sure if she should curtsy? Either way, you gotta commit. In agreement another tweeted, Shortest curtsy in royal history, twice. Others said that the mother-to-be should look to Prince Harry's cousin for lessons in the gesture. One wrote, Princess Eugenie had the best curtsy following her wedding. Total respect for the Queen. But others admitted that they felt sorry for Meghan and said she appeared unsure. One wrote, Are you sure she didn't know if to curtsy? She looks unsure while another added, I kinda feel sorry for her, looks like she wasn't sure and didn't have time ask ph. This is not the first time that the Duchess of Sussex has been hesitant when it comes to her curtsy. During the trooping the color fly passed on Buckingham Palace balcony in June close-up footage appeared to show Meghan discreetly asking Prince Harry, 33, whether it's time to curtsy as Queen Elizabeth arrives. In the video, Meghan, still smiling and looking ahead, appears to mouth do it in direction of her husband who seems to reply yes before promptly bowing his head. Protocol dictates that royals must curtsy in front of the Queen when they see her for the first time of the day. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex are on their final leg of their 16-day royal tour, ending it in New Zealand following the Invictus Games in Sydney. They are set to spend four days in New Zealand in total, before flying back to London on Wednesday.